Do what makes you happy because at the end of the day, you're the only person that you have to make happy. So it's been a year since I've been doing YouTube and anime content, and that's why I have this different take of trying to add a real life perspective to these animes that you guys watch. Because I believe that anime can be a part of your life. I just don't think it should be the sole purpose of your entire life. And I know that me saying that might be hypocritical because I'm trying to do an anime YouTube channel, but at the end of the day, anime can't be everything. There's real people, there's real life, there's real things that you have to take on, such as bills, taxes, investing, real estate, whatever it may be, you have to take that on and yes anime can be a part of it you can enjoy watching it every single day but it doesn't have to consume your every aspect of your life like i rarely if ever talk about anime with my friends this is the only time that i ever really talk about anime because it's not something that i necessarily want to talk about it's something that i just do in my free time it's something that i enjoy doing by myself it's something that just gives me slight little bits of joy so that's what i do and that's just how it is because everybody does things a certain way and i enjoy watching anime on my own I don't have to flaunt it or say it or change the way that I talk about it because other people are doing it as well. If I hear somebody else that brings it up, I'll be like, yeah, it's a pretty good show or you should watch this or you should watch that. But I never go into a conversation of, hey, you know, you should watch this anime or hey, do you watch anime? I instead ask people about themselves and that's what you should do instead. You should ask people about themselves. Don't bring up what you do. Don't bring up how you are like, yo, I love watching anime. I just watched this epic anime series. Instead, ask them like, what are their aspirations? What are their goals? What are they watching? What are they doing? What are they can consuming on a daily basis because this will bring them more fulfillment than you just honestly saying what you want to say about the show that you watched this past weekend like i mean just look at the most recent episode of attack on titan or demon slayer like it is getting fucking good guys but i'm not going to be telling people i'm not going to be like hey go watch this because it is the most amazing anime ever if they ask like hey what are you watching then i'd be like you know i watched attack on titan and demon slayer is pretty good and you should also check out Jujutsu kaisen like i would say shit like that but i don't because people don't ask if people ask them by all means i will happily say that or if they come over to my place and they see that i have like an anime poster up of drohidoro if they ask like oh yeah i see what they watch anime i'd be like yeah i do you do too and like no I think it's weird. I'd be like, all right, cool. Yeah, I enjoy it. And then like you just either you find some other common interest with that person or you just don't be friends with that person. Everybody that you talk with, you can find a common interest in regardless of what it is. And that could be anime. It could be investing. It could be sports. It could be TV. It could be gym. It could be movies. It could be real estate. It could be your career. It could be people. It could be anything that you want it to be. As long as you find an interest in it, other people will find an interest in it as well. And you just have to give those people the time and space to open up up to you because they'll be like hey you know this guy he's kind of cool he's got a cool perspective i want to tell him more about what i do because he seems interested and that's just kind of one of the best things that you could do because at the end of the day you're the only person that you have to make happy